G'day folks. Well, this video is for Haswell 1993. Uh, I'm still learning about capacitor banks myself and I just wanted to know just how big this bank is and just to show you here's a, here's a 385 volt DC 1000 microfarad cap from a VFD. Here's a good size comparison to what's in this. Bus bars are already hooked up in oh, I suppose that's positive. I got positive, negative. Okay. So I just got to work out how they hooked these up. Got two bars coming through here, and it's got a safety strap on it, shorting it out. And then they come across. So this side's still isolated. I think I've taken one of the bus bars off. Motor one, motor two, or something. Uh, not sure how to hook this one up. I haven't done a lot of work with capacitor banks. I know single capacitors pretty well, but big stuff like this, well, it's very easy to either blow it up or blow yourself up. And right now I'm not that fluent with the uh, capacitor side of things, so this one's just been sitting in storage, that's all. I just thought you might like to have a look at it. Each cap is 20, I think they're 2800 microfarad Phillips caps, 450 volt DC with maximum surge of I think 550. And they do seem to handle rapid discharges pretty well, so they're not a, not a uh, weak little item that's going to go pop the first time you discharge it into something. Even these ones are good. They're mainly designed for filtering out ripple current in the DC as it comes into the, into the variable speed drive. 